Hello people, hope you're doing great. This is you and welcome back to my channel. Well, today I'm watching Bururu episode 56. I'm still in shock from the last episode. Oh my god, all these episodes are so fast paced all of a sudden now. Or so many things happens like in one episode that you can't wrap your mind around it and you have to watch it all over again. Last episode, so suddenly we see these Otsusuki clan members visiting Earth and one of them, Momo, he grabbed eight tails literally inside his palm. Like eight tails is gone, gone. He's dead. And what about Killer B? I don't know. Man, this is this is like really, really shocking. And the next important thing we found out, Gara has a son. Like he adopted a son and he's already so grown up. He's coming to Leaf Village to participate in Chunin exams. I wonder what about the other two kids in his team? Are they Kankuru's kids? I'm not sure because, you know, when uh, Gara visited Leaf Village in Chunin exam, he brought Timari and Kankuro. So they all three were like siblings. So I'm just assuming maybe these three coming from Sand Village are also siblings, like in a way, I don't know. And um, maybe not. Oh my God, I'm just talking nonsense. I'm baffled and I'm just really, really worried about Naruto now. Okay, I will dive in right now and see for myself. But if you're new to my channel, then do subscribe and drop some likes and comments on this video. All right, let's hop in. Oh, is it finally Chunin exam today? Today's the written ah, test, is it? He's wearing that gadget. He knows he's cheating. He has this advantage because he is Hokage's son and none of his other friends have. So how come he... And he is uh, taking advantage of the fact that he's now to his son and he has access to the scientific lab and all these scientific gadgets. Uh, which other uh, classmates of his do not. So kind of in my head it is cheating. Um, also at the same time I understand that these exams or being a ninja it's never a fair ball game, right? So they, there are always some of the ninjas who have the advantages of kick again Kai. Some of them have advantages of their family clan lineage or whatever you want to call that. So yeah... I don't know. But all, all I'm surprised about the fact is that Boruto do not want to take help from Naruto, do not want to get any kind of support from his direction, but then he's still using the gadget. So in my mind, that's kind of, you know, going against your own life's mantra. Hey, For a change, Chocho is looking really good today. <laughs> what a drag. He had a change of heart. Oh! <laughs> No, he just wants to show off to his father and the entire world. See? Are they triplets? <laughs> the shadow clones by birth. Oh, wow. This one, he looks so dangerous. I agree with you, Babe. <laughs> Shut up, Metal. Do not lose confidence. Really? He's just gleaming with overconfidence. Yeah. Shinky, what's up with this cloak? No, the coat that he's wearing? It, it gives me, it's giving me like that uh, Shino vibe. Like, you know how he had beetles around, like wrapped around him. Like oh, I know what that quote is. Um, I remember now, you know, um, what was the first uh, Kaze Kage that um, Sasori made? Um, was it Sasori? Am I make No, yes. Sasori made his um, um, puppet. He He could do... Iron, um, iron sand, iron sand, right? Iron something, iron sand. It, yeah, you know, those, I, I remember Sakura fighting, um, uh, with Sasori and then those iron sand and stuff, like in the middle. I think, I think, uh, Shinki's coat is made up of that iron sand wrapped around him because, you know, because Gara has the original sand and he, he he's like a step ahead. And he's adoptive son, so like the generation next has an edge over, right? So I feel like it's iron sun. We'll find out. <laughs> Nobody 
nobody cares. <laughs> this generation. <laughs> they don't care. She get a Where's Naruto? I thought he's gonna be doing the opening speech. No? It's like more like a tourist uh, opportunity, like a tourism thing happening in their village. Ooh. But they don't look that scary. For, for like, they look okay. So you, they come to another village and they've been acting so rude. No etiquette whatsoever. So he is famous and he hates that fact. Who is that? Miski? That gave you chills? That's Miski for you. Now they're three, so move it. Borto, Kono Tatachi, do. Is that Iron Sand that I was talking about? Shinky's Iron Sand? See, I told you. I'm so good. I'm so, so good. Nanda, no manto. Kona Tokoro de Araso Tenanina. Yeah, fight it in the arena, in the exam. And put your metal there. So these enemies have already started building up. I really want to know about these two other team members of Shinki as well. Are they somehow related to Kankuro? That's uh, Shikadai's cousin. Right. Oh, Chojuro's here. Oh, that guy, what was his name? Kagura. Oh, so Kagura is not here. I thought we will see Kagura. Uh. I like his pink eyes, like Kagura's pink eyes. Oh, these triplets. Okay. I think this guy with the green hair, he's the most scary of them all. But I'm pretty sure Shinki has some hidden skills too. Okay, Baruto, I like your confidence, but do not turn it into overconfidence. Oh, uh, what was her name? Suchikage. Duh. <laughs> he didn't say that. Hmm. Not for really long, you know, Atsuki clan members are coming here. Momo is coming. That uh, woman who is accompanying uh, Chojuro is wearing a mask. Only she's concerned about uh, COVID-19. I mean, we should say COVID-22 now because it's 2022. True or false quiz? <laughs> what the hell? Is this their first event? <laughs> Sai, you're disappointing everyone here, including me! Oh, he already started the watch without even explaining the whole rules. Okay, he was just repeating the same thing and he already started the watch. But you started the watch. Exactly. Elite group. I doubt that. Oh! oh, oh, oh. Finally, 10 10. Girl, I was missing you. I was talking about you in the last episode. Where the hell were you? Were you? Wow. You're like. Bombing your students up, man. These kids. But better than, you know, those huge snakes that Sasuke and Naruto fought. Orochimaru came into that... Uh, what was that? Death, death forest. Forest of death. Oh! Whoa! So highly disappointing! 
Huh? I literally thought the green hair guy is like so scary that he would be like above par. And Shikamaru said something about elite group. Mirare na katta ne. Ibabe, you okay? Yeah, my Bobby thought. Actually, me too, me too. Bobby, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's embarrassing, right? Watching that on the big television along with your co workers like Kage's, and then you see your village kids are disappointing you. Brandon looks so hot. Like she's grown out to be a really good looking woman. So they're just fighting it with um, normal taijutsu. They're not actually showing jutsus here. Oh, oh. Chewing gum? Is it like, what? Is he throwing gums at them? Impressive. You must have a really hot jaw. Oh, let's see what these triplets can do. Good one. Ten ten. Your puppets are all beaten up. Okay, so they arrived, all of them arrived within the one hour time period. Okay. Oh, sure. <laughs> you haven't seen Gara in his young age, so does Shinke still okay? Okay. <laughs> So, Shinobi Shinobi Oh god, Boruto should know that. I thought like he is like kind of a bookworm. And so is Sarda. Oh. Tiny miny mo. Oh, so they have like what two minutes to do this? Boruto, what does no papa nara touch you? Erabu to mo. Batsu kana. So they're going towards true. What does your papa to chinga o michi o erande hokage ni naru no? Ja, maru de inda ne. Oh my god, that was. Uh, I didn't imagine that will be Sarda's reasoning of choosing true. I think they both, the both of them would be like uh, selected, but they will be bidding against each other. <laughs> what does that mean? I I thought it's a trampoline, but it's kind of it's a bell. They all are trapped. They all like now are fighting against each other. These are like two groups. That's how they separated each other. Group A would be something like that. There is no right or wrong answer. So there is something in the bottom. If you if you are unable to save yourself from dropping and dipping into that black thing. Whoever. Yeah, see? Chochi is still eating chips while hanging in there. Like really. Absolutely. And it's not going to be easy.下に広がる墨の池を見て自分たちが間違った選択をしたと受け入れてしまったやつ。ただ黒くなることを選んだやつ。この一時試験本当の選択は諦めるか諦めないか。そう、because <笑> <laughs> that he had no clue how to solve it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, come on. This is exactly like how, you know, Gara entered the tuning exam and how his trainer was trying to get the Shukaku out of uh, him. It's just like history repeating itself. Boruto is upset, like he's disappointed in himself that he couldn't figure out what's the right answer and he needed if, uh, Mitsuki and Sarda to save him. 
I have an ant on my computer screen right now. Aww, Boruto sent him an email. Come on, Boruto. Don't do it. Keep it. These small things, you will, you will. Okay, finally. If he's there. Okay, alright, so that was a good episode. Finally, the start of Chunin exams and Team 7 has passed the first round, which is great. Naruto is nowhere to be found and we know Otsusukis are coming to grab the Nine Tails from Naruto. I feel like it's gonna all happen in the round two, like, you know, where they fight each other, not even round two, I guess the round three when they finally ba battle each other in the final round. It's a random thought that I have that, you know, while the biggest fight would be would happen, it can be a battle between uh, the end battle between Boruto and Shinki because uh, they are the they kind of equal in a manner that um, they're both uh, they're both son of their respective kages of the village so a lot is riding on them and people are expecting a lot from them and people are like waiting um to see how boruto or shinki performs in the chunin exam so uh, that will be an interesting battle to look out for however i also feel that otsusuki is gonna like Crash the tuning exam and make an appearance there. Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. Anyways, uh, interesting episode, but I will wrap it out here. If you like this video, do drop some likes and comments. Do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And all my attributes are available on Patreon much earlier than YouTube. You can also send me a high five on Instagram or Twitter. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, bye.